All right, hello guys, and in this tutorial, I'm going to be teaching you how to stop thermal throttling on your AMD Ryzen CPU. Um, I've had this problem mainly because I just don't have a water cooler, and I think I fucked up my thermal pace, but eh, that's that's a whole other issue. So what you want to do is type in Ryzen Master, and this link should pop up for the AMD Ryzen uh, Master overclocking control thing. You can definitely overclock on this and tune a lot of very specific uh, settings, but uh, we're not going to worry about that because uh, we're not tech wizards. And I'm going to show you the simple easy way. So once you have that downloaded, um, you should be taken to this thing right here. And um, on top it should tell you your CPU, mine's a Ryzen 5 5500. And first off, what you want to do is uh, check control mode. If it is not on default, that means you've messed around in your BIOS and changed some stuff. So what you want to do is uh, go in your BIOS, uh, load the default BIOS settings. Uh, you can keep on um, uh, what you call it, uh, XMP, and you can change your uh, CPU offset. But that's the only thing you, things you can change about your CPU without it being on manual or auto OC. So uh, make sure that's on default and you will have the option to use curve optimizer blah, 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 curve optimizer mode. So uh, it should be on off but uh, just click all colors and click start optimizing. This should pop up and um, so what basically what it does is that um, it would test out or your CPU cores uh, together and individually and see which see like what overclocking or under voting it can do and basically optimize your CPU cores I already have this done so I'm not gonna waste my time and do that again but um this is really good my temps change from like why is it at why is it clocked oh it's probably it's OBS okay that's why but yeah my temps change from like 3.6 at like 90 degrees and rec when recording to like uh, 4.1 3 point something at 60 something degrees so really really helpful and I definitely recommend everyone do it um yeah uh, this is gonna be really short so then just click that start optimizing your computer will restart a few times and it might take like 30 minutes but once it's done it should be running a-okay just fine so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, really short guide to Ryzen Master. I'm not going to go into detail about this because like you can go advanced view and oh boy I'm just no hell no. So yeah that's going to be it and I'll see you sometime else.